And yeah. this next guy, he's a great friend of ours, has been for a we long love time, him. Katie. And for good reason. And he is in super red hot form at the moment. There's no doubt about no that. No one's hotter than Peter Hellier! Peter Hellier! Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Yeah! Wow, sit down, everybody. Sit down. If you're listening in your cars, I've just got a standing ovation. Whoa! That feels good. It's good to be on radio on Nova right now because the TV is giving me the, the, the you know, the, the shits. Um, can I say that, Husey? Thanks, mate. Uh, I, I was just last night, I was just yelling at the ads. Do you ever yell at the ads? Last night, I was just yelling at the ads, just going, get over it! Get over it, mate! Get it through your thick skull, mate! Your wife brought a Jeep! Get over it! That guy's got to shut up. Because we all know that guy's a sleaze bag. Because there's only one reason why your wife goes out and buys a Jeep. She found your second phone. That's why. She found those dirty emails being sent to your secretary. That's what she's found. A few guys have just gone pretty quiet in the front row. Yeah. Uh, good stuff. Uh, my, my show's called Snazzy. It wasn't the original title. Uh, my comedy festival show's called Snazzy. It was going to be called Kisses on the Bottom. Yeah. But Paul McCartney stole that album. He, Paul McCartney's new album, which Nova is completely ignoring. Uh, <laughs> is called Kisses on the Bottom, which is a great name for an album, I think, if your target uh, demographic is pedophiles. Um, I, <laughs> I, I, lo I, love, I love the name of the album. And uh, it's Paul McCartney, he's got the power. He's the next Beatle. He's got, you know, he goes, I'm rich, I'm wealthy, I'm powerful. I'm gonna call my album whatever I like and the studio executives can't say a word. Now that every, not every artist has that power, yeah? You know what I'm saying? Like Guy Sebastian. For example, imagine him going out to his record company executives and saying, hey guys, um, got the new album title. It's called Kisses on the Bottom. What do you think? They'll be like, guy, we don't like it. It sounds gay. It make you sound, it make you sound gay. We know you've had a wife and you're married and you've got a baby, but it make you sound gay. Your audience think you're gay. We kind of think you're gay. Let's stick with the original title. Let's stick with the original title, Guy on Guy. Let's do that. Just do that. You guys are great, fantastic. And I uh, saw some of you guys at the front. Two of you are having a pash. Where are those two? Two people are having a pash of breakfast, breakfast breath in the morning. It was very passionate. I'm not sure if I, who's in the public displays of affection. Anyone in the public displays of affection? You are. T behind you. Okay, you guys should pash later on in the show. Not during my set, though. <laughs> I'll tell you about the worst of public displays of affection. Rabbits. Rabbits are the worst. They are. I was at my uh, niece's, like, petting zoo kind of party recently and two rabbits thought it was an awesome time like in front of these eight-year-olds just to go at it in that really violent jackhammer rabbit way they're, they're completely naked their ears were flopping around it was it's not just rabbits animals in general in the last two weeks I've seen rabbits have sex I've seen dogs have sex I've seen horses have sex yeah yeah admittedly the last two were on the internet but it's <laughs> it was a public library so it still counts so so I saw a snake rear. Anyone scared of snakes? Yeah. I saw a snake in my house. Why are you scared of snakes, buddy? Why, why, why do you hate them? They're scary. Like they're scary. <laughs> yeah. Okay, they're scary. Okay, I'm going to cue you a fear of snakes, okay? Okay, imagine, okay, imagine if you, what, what do you do for a living? I'm a miner. You're a miner. Yeah. Okay, I'll work this one out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're in a mine. Somebody said, hey, buddy, what's your name? Serge. Serge, um, don't go leave the mine. There's a snake outside, okay? And he's biting, and his bites are poisonous, which are the worst kind of snake uh, bites, okay? And you go, bloody hell, I'm not leaving the mine. I'm staying in the mine. But then he goes, hey, go, settle down, Serge. I've got more information, okay? The guy biting upstairs doesn't have any legs, and he doesn't have any arms. <laughs> you wouldn't be so bloody scared, would you? You'd be passing him every morning, bipping your own, going, ah, you can't bloody bike. Ah, 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 piss off. Ah, 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 ah. When I speak to Hallie, the show's got snazzy. Come along. Yes. <laughs>